picture yourself in a Hi. Today, All Access Music News has branched out to a new area. We are going to cover items that are not necessarily directly tied to music. Items that we find interesting. Today, we had the thrill and the privilege of meeting and interviewing the world-renowned artist Peter Max. So without any further ado, here's the interview. And did they, did you get to work directly with them? I work with them on an independent basis, you know, with Paul a little bit, and with John, I meet them independently, and sometimes I would see two of them together. And I was good friends with Yoko for maybe five, six, seven years. And I knew John, and I never knew to introduce them. And one day Yoko called me up and she said, Hi, Peter, did you hear? I said, Yes, Yoko, congratulations. It's unbelievable. Oh, my gosh. You could have played matchmaker. <laughs> I could have, but if you only knew. <laughs> so, um, so um, tell me um, about your most recent work. It's always everything is recent. I'm just painting and doing all the time. So. So there's a, it, it, it evolves, it changes, it just it does what it wants to do. I kind of follow it. And you follow your art, and then the other way around. Yeah, yeah. Like if you would go on the street humming, you, you, you're not going to designate in your mind what you're humming. You just hum, and you hum, and you hum something you know, something you don't know. It's the same thing for me, like this painting behind you, or these paintings, unless you know, I decide to do a specific image, you know like this one or that one, but most of them, 99.9% .9 of my work is just evolving when I'm at the canvas, listening to music, and then about halfway through I know what, what it's going to be. I know it's kind of like saying, who's your favorite child, which isn't fair, but is there, is there a, an area or a, a, a particular style, or not style, but yeah, look style. that you like? Yeah, I, I like them all. Every look I is an evolution. I go from this, I go to that. And, uh, you know, when I'm doing it, I love it. So, I love that moment. Oh, it's amazing. Are you looking forward to working with the Grammys? That's it? I've done it five times. I was the official artist for the Grammys five times. I love it. I love the Grammy people. I love the Grammys. I'm a huge musical artist. And yes. Big, big. Music, so. I like music. I like films. I'm now uh, really uh, developing uh, storylines and pick all the music for seven animated films. Which really? I mean, yeah, that may take me a year or two to do them in three. And I'm just, just like, you know, I didn't want to make a layout of the drawings, and I didn't want to write the story. I decided to listen to music and pick music a lot first. And that's going to be my base. So the other way around. Yeah. Wow. Matter. Well, that's, that's, uh, that's more comfortable to feel. <coughs> I'm doing mean, the way it felt like doing. I didn't call up anybody, Spielberg or anybody, and say like, "Well, how do you how do you start it?" You know, I just picked music I loved, and as I was listening to it, I said, "Boy, this is great stuff I could animate to." So I decided, and I listened. I, I gathered from all kinds of people, you know, from you know, a couple of Beatles, I got a couple of thousand songs, and Joe, my photographer, and a thousand, a couple of other friends. I had a thousand or two. I eventually, had about nine thousand, three hundred songs. Me. <laughs> Technology calls. <laughs> okay. Okay. We'll a couple more minutes, right? Yeah, yeah. That's Last it. Last question. Is there anything that you you'd like to do that you haven't done yet? No, everything I want to do, I'm doing. So it's like if I want to do it, I I do it. You know, I want to make a film, but I said I'm not going to write a film, so. And I said, why, this wouldn't be nice music for film. So that suddenly got me into picking music for the film. I didn't decide to pick 9,000 songs. So I saw what I had, and then I realized this kind of music, this kind of has these people, those people, everybody sent me over to daily give me things that this big. There's like 800 songs in them. And, uh, Which is good, and that's bad. It's good. I don't know what's bad about it. You have too many choices. <laughs> no, it's great. You have a lot of choices, and then you. Now, after I've listened to all of them, I've, you know, the nicest thing about the iPods, I, I had 23 iPods, <laughs> and I still have them all on the, on, on the iPods, and uh, every time I like something, it's, it's five stars, and it's almost great, it's four stars, 
If I don't like it, I just don't rate it. So I rated about of the 9,000 songs, maybe 3,000, 4,000, which is like about half. Mm -hmm. But I could not probably use even maybe one third at the most. Yeah, so that's a, a, a good problem to have. It's, it's good, you know, it's nice, and I have choices. Well, we wish you the best of luck with that, and it's, it's been an honor. Thank you for sharing this thank time you. with us and our readers.